Hello friends, it's me, Mrs. Ross. We are moving on to our wind experiment today. So I need you guys to get your paper out. We are actually gonna be doing a couple experiments. If the superheroes end up getting blown over, there's Legos, there's Toy Story, and the most important is the trash to see what happens to the trash when it just gets put all over the place, okay? So we've got a whole bunch of different experiments to do with one paper, so you guys get to choose one experiment, or you could actually do this at home after you watch all of our experiments, okay? Here we go. Hello boys and girls, Mrs. Ross. We are outside, it is a cold windy day, and we are gonna be doing our wind experiments to see what is gonna blow over and what is not. Are you guys ready? If you notice, I am in a place where there is nothing blocking the wind. It's just coming right at us. Here we go. All right, experiment one, our superheroes experiment. Which one is gonna blow over first? Is it Spidey? Is it? Black Panther. Is it? Rocket. Or? Thor. Oh, Thor fell first, oh my! And Rocket and Spidey are still standing. All right, next is our Toy Story experiment. Who's gonna fall over? Is it gonna be Buzz? Is it gonna be Spoony or Forky? Spoony, Forky, Forky, Spoony. And we've got Woody and we've got the Daredevil at the end. Who's it gonna be? Let's see. Oh, Woody and the Daredevil at the end. We still have Forky and Buzz Lightyear standing. These are our Harry Potter Legos from our recent Harry Potter build. We've got Hermione, we've got, oh, Hermione went down first. <gasps> then Hagrid, then Harry. <gasps> but we still have Madame Pumphreys at the end who did not fall. Way to go. All right, our next test is our homework test. Ready and... We've got our reading books, we've got our science, we've got our alphabet, we've got our math, which is gonna go away first, let's see. Let go, let go, let go. Woo. Our math. All right, our last test has to do with trash. Okay, so you guys see trash all over the place. This is what happens when the wind blows and the trash that's left on the ground, where does it go? Well, we're gonna soon find out. It looks like our bubbles and our mask were the first to go. All right, we just did our experiment outside with the wind. We are gonna be drawing two items that were easy to blow over, and then we're gonna draw two items that were hard to blow over. All right, so up here, two items that were easy to blow. Easy. So I'm gonna use my crayon, and I'm gonna, you can either draw a picture or write. I'm gonna write the word and then draw the picture, okay? So my two things that I'm gonna write that were very easy to fall over. Thor fell over very quickly. So I'm gonna write Thor here. The TH makes the sound. Now because of its name of something or someone, I have to put a capital at the beginning. So I'm putting a capital T, H, and then O, R. So, or, Thor. Oh, our math journal, our math journal really flew away. So I'm gonna write math journal. So m a -th. we have that th again. The th makes the sound and journal. Now before I draw the pictures, I'm gonna go down for the two things that were hard to blow over. Now remember, we did a whole bunch of different experiments. The cardboard box. The cardboard box didn't really move that much. Buzz did not all over at all. He stayed nice and strong. So I'm gonna write Buzz. Because Buzz is his name, I need to do a capital. Buzz Lightyear. I'm just gonna write Buzz. Okay, now at the bottom it says, color the types of weather found at this station. Well, the station we were at was at the top of a play structure and I can tell you it was windy up there and it was freezing cold. But it wasn't snowy. We've got wind. We've got rain, there was no rain, 
there was some clouds up in the sky and the sun was out. So I'm actually going to be coloring each one of these. All right, now let's draw all our pictures. All right, good job you guys. Have a wonderful day and keep being awesome.